so here is the second question it says how many odd numbers between 150 and 350 are there which are neither divisible by 9 nor by 11 let's calculate that first of all how many odd numbers are there in this range the first odd number is 151 the next odd number is 153 so on and so forth the last odd number is 349 so it's kind of an ap series right it is kind of an ap series in an ap series how do you get to know about the total number of terms there is a formula for that that tn is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d here tn is equal to 349 a is 151 that is the first term plus n minus 1 into d is the common difference which is equal to 2 from there i get 349 minus 151 so 349 minus 149 is 200 further 2 is subtracted it is 198 divided by 2 is n minus 1 so n is equal to 99 plus 1 that is equal to 100 though now i mean uh, uh, in an exam time you should make it a habit that rather than doing this whole process we should just be doing this minus this divided by the common difference plus 1 349 minus 151 divided by the common difference which is 2 plus 1 ultimately this only thing happens over here but that's just a fast way of doing this next Question says none of them should be divisible by 9 or 11. So let's calculate the number of numbers which are divisible by 9 or 11. I'll subtract that from the total. So how many multiples of 9 are there? The first multiple of 9 is 153 in this range. That is 17 into 9. Of course, the next would be 19 into 9 because you are talking about odd numbers. Just keep that in mind, which is 171. And that way it would go on. So what is the last number which is divisible by 9? It is 342, but 42 is a prime, sorry, uh, even number. So the last number is 333. And 333 is 9 into 27, right? So I have 9 into 17, I have 9 into 19, I have 9 into 21, up to 27. So you can roughly count these numbers that are a total of 6 numbers which are there in this range. 9 into 17, 9 into 19, 9 into 21, and that way is going up to 9 into 27 so 6 numbers are there divisible by 9 how many numbers are divisible by 11 let's talk about them as well the first multiple of 9 which is divisible by 7 i'm sorry i think it was uh, 37 not 27 i'm really sorry so it was not 6 that means it was equal to 11 how many multiples of 11 are there the first multiple of 11 is 154 that is 11 into 14 of course, I will not have to take the even numbers. So, 154 will not be taken. I am sorry. The first number taken would be 165. That is 11 into 15. And next would be 11 into 17. That is 187. And that way the series would go on. So, what is the last number before 349, which is divisible by 11? It is 341, which is 11 into 31. So, how many such numbers are there? 15, 17 up to 31. So that makes a total of, I think, 9 numbers if I'm not wrong, 15, 17, 19, 21, 23, 25, 27, and 29 and 31, right? So there are 9 numbers there. After that, when we talk about those numbers which are divisible by 9 and 11 both, now numbers divisible by 9 and 11 both, that means the numbers divisible by 99 and those two odd numbers. In this range, I have just one number that is 297, which is 99 into 1. So, 11 numbers are divisible by 9. 9 numbers are divisible by 11. That makes 20. But this one number is counted twice. So, ultimately 19 numbers are there which are divisible by 9 or 11. Subtracted from total, it gives you 81 numbers which are neither divisible by 9 nor divisible by 11. And by that logic, we get the answer as 81 for this question. Right? So, for question number 2, the correct answer is option C.